students our today's session will be based on balanced diet importance of exercise and need of proper rest i hope you remember what we studied in the last session in the last session we got introduction of this lesson then we also studied what is balanced diet and we tried to understand three nutrients that is carbohydrate proteins and fats in this session we will be studying two more nutrients which are vitamins and minerals after studying vitamins and minerals we will be also studying importance of exercise and need of proper rest so to begin with let us start with vitamins vitamins keep our body fit improve appetite and help us to fight diseases that's why vitamins are important it is required in very small quantity not too much we don't need to take supplements of vitamins unless and until doctor has advised a fruit or a vegetable can give you sufficient amount of vitamins because they are not required in large amount though vitamins are required in small amount still we must have the foods which contain vitamins regularly and what are the types of vitamins a b c d e and k these are the types of vitamins that we should have regularly in our diet now after vitamins the next nutrient that we out to study is minerals minerals help in formation of bones teeth and blood and these are very essential for our body bones teeth and blood and for the formation of these three things minerals are very necessary examples of minerals are calcium potassium sodium iodine and iron so these are the examples of minerals where do we find minerals and vitamins in which type of food so these are the various kind of fruits and vegetables which i have shown here which contains vitamins and minerals so fresh fruits and vegetables are the good sources of vitamins and minerals so we must have not all but at least a one or two fruit and maybe uh, twice or thrice a week we must have vegetables why because they contain these essential vitamins and minerals after studying vitamins and minerals the next type of nutrient some people don't count it as nutrient because we cannot digest it but still it is important in our diet and that thing is roughage or fiber roughage are present in fruits and vegetables and help the body to get rid of undigested food very important though we cannot digest roughage and fiber it is essential for digestion why it is essential because it is useful in getting rid of undigested food so undigested food which is not helpful or beneficial for our body is expelled out or we get rid of it with the help of roughage or fiber and so roughage or fibers are important and where do we find it we find it in fruits and vegetables so fruits and vegetables are very good source of nutrients we get um, vitamins we get minerals we also get roughage from fruits and vegetables the next thing that we are going to study today is importance of exercise why is exercise important for our body and for our mind so let us try to understand why keeping fit is important muscles become weak and flabby if they are not used for long time for instance if we sit for a long time or if we uh, sleep for a long time then our muscles become weak and flabby though rest is important exercise is equally important so 
Why it is important? Because our muscles become weak and flabby if they are not used for a long time. And what is the solution to it? Regular exercise. Regular exercise helps to develop and tone up our muscles. And what do these muscles do? It keeps our body fit. Other thing that exercises do is heartbeats. Heartbeats faster leading to faster blood circulation. Exercise helps nervous system by supplying more oxygen to the brain. So these are other few things that exercise do. So exercise not only keeps our body externally fit but internally also. Internally also it gives um, a required supply of oxygen to the brain. It gives exercise to our heart. There is a pro uh, proper blood circulation because of exercise. And the result of all this is our body and our mind becomes fit for everything. The last point that we are going to discuss in today's session is need of rest. Along with a healthy diet, along with a regular exercise, a proper sleep, proper rest is also important to keep ourselves fit and healthy. So let us understand importance of resting. Enough rest. Proper sleep and regular hours of sleep relax our muscles and give our body the much needed rest. Even our internal organs require proper rest, proper relaxation so that they can function properly every day. Sleep gives our body time to grow and repair body cells. What happens is, in our daily routine, there is some wear and tear in our body. Our body cells get damaged internally and even when we are growing in our teenage or when we are kids, growth is equally important and this happens when we are sleeping. So what does sleep give? Sleep gives our body time to grow and repair body cells. With proper sleep, we can work more efficiently. If we get enough rest, the next day we can work more efficiently. So sleeping or taking rest is equally important for our daily routine or for the work which we do. Now that we have understood the importance of a balanced diet, exercise and rest, there are few things which you can try out at home and those things or those questions are what are the sources of vitamins and minerals this is the first question second is how does roughage help in digestion i repeat how does roughage help in digestion the next question is explain how exercise helps us in keeping ourselves fit i repeat explain how exercise help us in keeping ourselves fit and the last question is why is taking rest important we have discussed all these points so you will easily find the answers to this question in the session itself so i hope you have understood the topic and i also hope you have enjoyed the topic so that was all for today. If you have any doubt, feel free to ask. You can put your questions in a comment box. 
सो सी यू इन नेक्स्ट सेशन अंटिल देन टेक केयर बाय बाय